It's a great time in COD Mobile for free-to-play players because they just announced the first ever free legendary weapon in the game. That means if you don't have the money to buy lucky draws, then you can also finally get a legendary weapon. In this video, I'll be teaching you how to unlock this free legendary weapon and I'll also be talking about some more details about the gun like whether it's gonna be permanent or not. So grab your snacks and enjoy the video. First, let's talk about the most important thing which is how to unlock this free legendary weapon. And by the way, the weapon is gonna be a legendary DRH called the Kurohana 68. So basically, to get this legendary DRH, you need to grind two different things. One of them being the legendary medals and the other is the confidential token. To unlock the free legendary DRH, you need 6 of these legendary medals along with 4 confidential tokens. But first we need to learn about how to get these 2 different things so let's start with the legendary medals. So let's say you get to legendary and multiplayer, that's one legendary medal right there. And then if you start grinding BR matches, you'll get another legendary medal after reaching legendary. But you can also get 2 extra legendary medals per season by playing a lot of COD Mobile. Basically if you manage to get to the top 5000 players on your region, then you'll be given an extra legendary medal for that game mode. And this applies to both multiplayer and battle royale. So in summary, there's two ways to get legendary medals, one by reaching legendary and one by getting to the top 5000. If you do the math, you can get four legendary medals per season, which is a pretty good amount considering how much you need to unlock this gun. Now for the confidential tokens, you can get them by completing the manufacturer documents, which can be found in the rank section of the game. Usually you can find the confidential token on the first document and these documents are pretty easy to complete. For example, this one tells me to play 10 ranked matches, which is a piece of cake. But the twist here is that you can only complete the manufacturer documents of the current rank season. So if you missed the chance to complete the manufacturer documents of the previous seasons, then you're out of luck because you need four of these tokens. But unless you're super new to the game, the chances are you already have four of these tokens, so you shouldn't be worried. And after completing all the requirements, you'll unlock the Kurohana crate in season 11, which has the free legendary DRH inside it. December is the month when everybody is gonna get this crate, as that's when the new rank series starts. So until then, we gotta wait for this crate to drop. But since this will be the first ever free legendary weapon in the game, we need to talk about the look. If we take a look at the picture that was posted on COD Mobile's Instagram, we can see how the weapon should look. Having a look at the gun, we can see that it has a Japanese Kurohana logo on the side, similar to the Mythic Switchblade X9. Although the Switchblade X9 has a glowing logo, but this one doesn't seem to be glowing, but you do gotta keep in mind that that is a Mythic weapon and this is a legendary one that we're talking about. It also seems to have some really nice looking geometrical shapes like the ASVAL Double Edge. Here's some reference from the ASVAL Double Edge so you can get an idea of how the barrel of this gun is gonna look. Pretty solid if you ask me. We can also see a magma shaped stock on this gun which should look very very, very nice when you're holding it. I think it got inspired by the magma camo, but it looks a little bit different. The gun also seems to have a jaguar shaped iron sight, which we have to see how it looks when it's released. Overall, I'd give the looks of this gun a solid 8 out of 10. And finally, we're gonna answer the question that everybody is waiting for, and that is, will this stay on your account forever? Now, as of right now, we don't have any official information about this question, but it is highly likely that this will be a permanent weapon that you can get for free. Because everybody has been grinding for this weapon for the entire year, and it is highly unlikely that they're gonna give it to us for only seven days but take this with a grain of salt because this is only my speculations and i could be wrong but it is highly unlikely that they're gonna give it to us for only seven days because we've been grinding for this weapon for the entire year but yeah if you want to get some free mythic weapons right now then make sure to check out this video i talked about a very simple way to get some free mythic weapons on that video so make sure to check it out but that's all for today and i'll see you guys later peace out